Rio, do Rio Grande.
helpful to you, I really do that you to join me at Civic Marriage.
dance floor. The dance floor is always open. Any dancers on this side? Yeah. Yeah. Look at the dancers, dancers, show my hands up. Come, come. Come, 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 Alright, so this is your first time and we have to begin introduction. We love to play music to make people dance and have a good time. And we're going to demonstrate that. So I'm your dancing partner for this evening, right? So we're going to introduce our next vocalist. He's coming to serenade, so for now it's Lauren. You call her Lauren. You look like a Lauren. She look like a Lauren. Only two big kids. You can believe this? I don't know what I'm talking about. Every ship I walk again, I know. Very good. Very good. I'll be fine. So, imagine, it's two years now. You can burn. Eh? But we're looking forward to it for 2023, eh? So, we're not going to be a bed. Somewhere around 4 o'clock in the morning, play school. And somebody was going to say, Lauren, you better wake up.
the Defense Force Team Orchestra as they are waiting to make a lap around the Prop Harris coming out of San Fernando. But of course, we want to give you the finals, the grand finale, the courts, the curtain closer. So you are ready? Of course, we must touch on our soca music. Anybody inside here that soca music? Of course, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, once more, you're listening to one of the most versatile, one of the most dynamic, the most prolific and entertaining. I can Good job. 
Good evening. We're here celebrating the 60th year of independence of Trinidad and Tobago under the auspices of the President of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. And today was an excellent event. The weather, the gods held up the rain for us. We got some drizzle that showed that signaled some blessings for us. And so now it was a free event, a free concert. We had the benefit of the prison's band, excellent performances. The Steel Orchestra from the Defense Force, excellent performances. We had the uh, junior with his uh, Moko Jumbies. It was this crowd certainly had a great time here this evening. We certainly enjoyed this, this event this evening in San Fernando. And as as we heard, they saved the best for last as we end the 60th year of independence celebrations in San Fernando this evening. Thank you. Our council for Springfield Paradise. Our council. Our council for Springfield Paradise. I give out thanks to all our San Fernando people and so people all around who are coming out for patriotism on our 60th anniversary of independence. Thank you to the president, the scholar, the ladies, for having and hosting an event of this magnitude in San Fernando. The crowd here turned out for performances by the and the police band, and we had a harness, we had no pajamas, and we, the most important part, we had a little chip around the block, but we had sat for that, we had that is sat for that. If this is what Carnival 2022 will look like, call me, call me. You see, on my left is prison's band, we're there, and we end up, and we have the council, we have the business community, we have Sunny Blaine right here. We have a host of celebrities, a host of people entertaining us. But we're now looking forward to the Carnival 2020. Again, I want to thank the President and mostly I want to thank the people of San Fernando for coming. Get one with Junior, get one with Junior. They're calling me. Who is this lady, Junior? Well, we're going back in 1988 oh when San Fernando became a city, and some young ladies, young ladies at the time, were contestants and qualified, and they are part of the evolution of San Fernando and the San Fernando over the years. I was happy to see her back here after all these years to celebrate the 60th anniversary and enjoy this special trip along the block this evening. And I was compliment the president for the other conversation. I said, but President, we're going on here to get a talk. He said, no, we can make it happen. You tell me what it is. So I had to negotiate with the church to make sure we had no service tonight. And the other church had no service. Wow. Like, that we had this area available to us. Oh. And we were able to put it back. If you had come last night, they had an anti-day church out of the city. Okay. So we thought they have no service on Sunday night. We have this area going this way. And of course, we have like, oh, I thought it was really good. But you hear that one? <laughs> that was my home, eh? <laughs> <laughs> right. All right, folks, so yes, she was celebrating, and um, I was the MC for the Excellencies Diamond Jubilee Concert Series. We spent the entire 60 of independence, and all the nice experience we had Sunday after Sunday up on the President's grounds, and then we wrap things up today, right here in San Fernando House. We are really pleased to be a part of the, um, the entire tour. Every performing member 
was a member of one of these serious bands, all right? As in, we saw them dancing, they are police officers. We see them playing, they are police officers. So, so, so we didn't just pull the performance on the street. They actually have real people who are involved in the serious and they are also very much performing in the entertainment and the arts. And then nice are the moments of really experience for families, friends to come along and experience a little bit about the children who are playing right and black. And of course, the excellent support and maybe to being here alongside the different players and different issues that would come along. Okay, my name is Cipriani Batis. I am the retired Commissioner of Prisons. I took over the reins of the prisons after Mr. Michael Luke was assassinated in 1993. I joined the prison service in the year 1961 and uh, next couple of years I age. Starting with uh, the, the big nine. That is with the JD and the execution. Okay. I was the commissioner then who had to oversee the execution. Right? I was born and, and, and born up in uh, agricultural district of coal mine in Sandy Grand. Okay. And I have spent 40 of my years in the prison service. I have been a member of the Trinidad and Tobago Cricket Board of Control and I have traveled to many countries on conference, America, New York, um, England, uh, the, the Netherlands, Canada and what have you. I'm enjoying my life now. I continue to support the prison service and give them whatever experience I have and support them in all the endeavors. Okay, so I imagine you have uh, children or grandchildren who might have taken after you. Oh, oh yes, I have uh, two a grandson and a granddaughter. Right? And they are all in America right now. And, and they all will be coming down to spend my 81st birthday with me on the 28th of this month. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Enjoy your birthday. We are missing from Mustafa Lessa from the Sipero. To be here this afternoon. Enjoy what San Fernando has been missing for a very long time. Go ahead. Over 20 two years I'm beyond, we were unable to be outside here. So today we are really happy as we have in Colombia meets the President of the Republic of Turkey to be able to assist us. We want to say thank you to the prison band, the entertainers in the prison band, as well as our worship in the other city of San Fernando, as well as our counselors, the media, and the citizens of the city of San Fernando. I, I am pretty sure that everybody had a wonderful time this afternoon. And everybody, the weather, the intermittent weather just held up for a period of time, we were able to have some fun. And we shipped around the block with the, with the president. So I want to say that thanks to everyone who made it possible this afternoon and thanks for the media to stream in us live this afternoon. So thanks on behalf of this of Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes.